There's a part of me that kind of wishes I'd never tried Ensley Rain Cosmetics because now I know I like them and that's an expensive fact to know. A massive thank you to Makeup Release Radar for the info on this. Let's talk about it. Basically, Ensley Rain have taken an existing palette of theirs, the Flower Moon, and they've given it a little bit of a revamp. And part of that revamp includes three new multi-chromes and three new mattes. And part of what I'm liking about this is it's $69, which yes is expensive however it's not as expensive as some of their previous palettes so i'm kind of okay with that the palette itself is absolutely gorgeous and i think they're saying it might come out on the 9th of may this is stunning now yes they have a row there of mattes what i have said before and i will say it until the end of time i think they're one of the few brands that could actually get away with just doing a full multi-chrome palette there's a part of me that kind of feels like just having a third of your palette be mattes is probably not quite enough. That being said, I think it's absolutely stunning. And you can really see that when you're looking at the swatches. I mean, look at that. That just makes you want to run through the forest on like an autumn's day and roll around in the leaves. And this is just giving like wood nymph, fairy sprite. It's so kind of magical and witchy. And I am here for all of the aesthetics on that. When you see the colour stories together, I think it just looks absolutely fab you less do i think that you have enough mattes there to create a whole look no i think you're actually going to have to dip in with another palette do i care that much no not really i think this is actually super super pretty i really like this and i do want to pick it up at some point i think the price point isn't awful for an indie brand would i like it to be cheaper yes but there's usually codes that will get you like 10 percent off I think it's really nice. What do you guys think? I have this over on my Instagram stories right now so you can have a little vote or if you're lazy like me, just leave a comment down below.